This is Halls Falls. It's just outside of St. Helens. The walk's not too long. I think it's about 900 metres. The best bit is dogs are allowed here. A quick Google search to see if Halls Falls is dog friendly results in a lot of conflicting information. However, after talking to some of the locals, using the tourism and hiking sites, as well as checking the regularly updated break-a-day council dog zones, it became pretty clear that dogs were welcome on leave. An easy rule to follow to keep your dog, the local wildlife and other walkers protected. I've linked some of the resources we use in our planning in the description below. It also helped that we passed three or four dogs on our way in and out of this popular spot. The short walk is graded as a level 3 with some tree scrambles, steep slopes and some slippery stairs. Daisy. Well and truly tangled. <laughs> Daisy. <laughs> cool. This is the whole Falls lookout. Terrible days. Did you know that water falling from waterfalls actually releases negative ions, which is why people are happy when they're around them? Oh. Did you Google that? So do go chasing waterfalls. You are far from miserable. You can see on the display at the top of the image, it's a little bit washed out. It almost looks dreamy. It's because the sun is looking directly into the shot. So all I'm doing to cover that is, I've got a two second delay on, all I'm doing to cover that area is actually just put my hand over the top, blocks out the light just a little bit. And it means that the sky is clearer and we can actually see the blue in the sky. This also works really well if you have a hat or some sort of shade that you can just throw out on the top. Got a hand in face. We nearly skipped this waterfall and it's definitely the best one out of the lot. This was to the right of the lookout. We thought it was just rock pools. We decided that we were just going to walk back to camp and actually walk past the turn off and then decided to turn around just to check it out just in case. Pretty glad we did. It's huge. Leash and Dave found a spot in the rock pool that we could sit and dip our feet. The water was icy and we couldn't leave them in there for too long.
Not a bad find. All right, matey, as you were. Echidna looking for a feed. After our morning walk, we headed back to the Big Four and treated ourselves to the pizza oven. 